there is a doctor on uh my uh, lord was uh working oh, for the was he a uh a physical therapist was he a therapist it was a um right. he was a doctor like just yeah. straight up he was a doctor on the US, US Olympic team and for MSU um, Michigan State Michigan State Victoria, if you know all this stuff, uh, so uh, she read about the boy on the way here. It was over. <laughs> 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 it was over a period of years, um, that he uh, so there had been initial allegations about him over time. Like it's just, it just didn't it didn't start like yesterday. Yeah. Did you say his name? I don't know. Have like you said his name? It's yes, um. Sir. Say what? I don't know if you Nasser Nasser. Yeah. N a s s a r. Yeah. Keep going. Keep going. I'm, I'll find the name. Uh, so, uh, Larry Nasser. I, I thought it was something like that. Larry uh, Nasser. Larry. Larry. <laughs> Larry. So, uh, over time, he had been accused of sexually assaulting um, gymnasts um, and athletes or, um, like just over the years. At one point, I know one gymnast... Um, went to her team captain and was like, "Hey, I think he assaulted me." Like, in I don't think in the '90s, was, I didn't think it was okay. And the, and the team captain was like, "Yeah, I'm sorry. Like, you probably don't know the difference between a sexual assault and medical procedure." Oh, uh, okay. Oh, uh, yeah. Mm. So, uh, okay. So yeah, it's it was a lot of back and yeah, forth. Yeah, that's that's tough. It was, yeah, it was a lot of back and forth. Um. But come to find out, it got to the point where uh, somebody, I forgot who reported it, and they paid her uh, $1.25 million to basically like keep quiet about it. It was like hush money. And um, if she said anything about it, she would face a $100,000 fine. Um, yeah, it's crazy. Uh, long story short, he uh, ended up, of course, in court for this, and they gave him... I think 175 70, years. 70 to 175 years mm-hmm. in prison. Uh, 40 to 175 years. So I think the judge signed his death Yeah, she was like, I yeah, signed cool. your death warrant. Like, like you're never going to see the light of day again. <laughs> oh, my gosh. Um, like, so, so, like, yeah. Go ahead. Go for it. Yeah, so that's like, that was like a, a big thing. Um and I'm not sure, but I don't think he was, I don't think he refuted it or anything. I don't think he was fighting no, back. No, he didn't. He didn't he fight kept, back. He kept saying stuff like, oh, no, this was like, this was medical procedure, you know, whatever, whatever, like all of this stuff. And I'm just like, nah, bro, this is not medical procedure. Like, yeah, one the of the stuff th- that the girl, like multiple girls yeah. were saying the exact same thing about this dude. Like, you are touching them downstairs with no gloves on wow like and making it seem like this is a medical procedure no absolutely not wow. yeah that's why wow. you know what i'm saying Dang. so like yeah i wish i wish aaron was here to talk 156 girls, girls testify that's what i'm saying Whew. that's bananas like simone biles yeah. Um, um, Allie. Gabby Douglas, Allie yeah, Raisman, yeah, all, all of these girls, like that we've seen doing their thing, killing it. Um, you know what I'm saying? I want to say, ah, not Dominique. I don't think it goes as far back as Dominique, back. but it goes. I mean, he was he was doing this stuff in the '90s. Shout out to Dominique Dawes, mm-hmm. classic. Mm-hmm. When was Dominique? '94, '95, '96 Olympics. So she okay. was mm-hmm. a big deal. Uh, so. Go ahead, go ahead. All right, last thing. He he previously got, he pled guilty, like, during this whole thing. He also pled guilty to uh, possession of child pornography. He got 60 years. He got 60 years for that. And then, like, so they gave him credit yeah. towards the 60 yeah, time years. Yes. And, yeah. But it's like, she was like, they, somebody in the news was like, so he's probably not going to get out. Um, <laughs> he probably, he he probably not going to make it out of jail. I'm like, who you know? <laughs> yeah. See if he don't die in jail. Like, if he get out early for good behavior, still be like something like. He's not going to have no life. Yeah. They still taking OJ to court. <laughs> they going to let that boy out a day before he die. Enjoy. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> Yeah, um, yeah, um, 
one of the uh one of the <laughs> I was about to say cheerleaders, excuse me. One of the gymnasts, um, you know, she's she's been like receiving um, you know, grand applause mm. for like the the speech that she gave this mm-hmm. dude. Oh. It was I'm like was sitting deep. there like six minutes, like, uh like it was my deep. face was like, man, like it was deep. And she was like, you know, just <laughs> and it's it's like it makes you think. It makes you think like God, even like Lord, even even, the, the even this person, even this person, I'm to to show mercy to. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean? Even to this person, still. You know what I mean? Like, how do you do that without with like without letting them feel like what they did wasn't wrong? How do you do that without mm. you know what I mean? Like how and do you she do did a good job at that? Huh? Yeah, bro. No, she didn't do a good job of that. No, no, no. She and I. But here's that. That's why I thought about it like this. Because who, who would fault her for just lashing out this at, yeah. at this man? Right. Who would fault her for just saying whatever it is that she wanted to say to this man? Like, oh, your letter was trash. Like your letter yeah. of forgiveness was trash. Bump that letter of forgiveness. You are the scum of the earth. You yeah. know what I mean? Saying stuff like this to this man. Like, Allie you, went. You, in. Yeah, she went clean <laughs> off on this man. And I'm like, dang, like there is no grace in, in this thing. And yeah. it's like, you can't fault somebody for, I, I don't fault people for not having grace on people. Yeah. I mean, to whom much grace is given, much grace is required. You know what I mean? She's never had to have, she's probably never had to have that much grace bestowed upon her. Yeah. So how could you possibly know what it feels like? Yeah, yeah, yeah know what it feels like. And so, so I'm not I'm not don't get me wrong I'm not advocating for anything that he's that he's done I'm really not right but it's, I'm just thinking from the from the lens of a of a believer from the lens of a Christian it's like dag even this person mm-hmm. yeah you know what I mean even him so I have to show this is love this is and what, compassion too this is what makes it so hard the fact that you not once shed a tear Yo, I was thinking the same Bro, thing. Stone, the fact stone that you, face. Right. The fact that you got stone up there. Stone face. The whole time. Go ahead, man. The fact that you got up there and said, no, this was procedure. Like, I was doing what I was supposed to have been doing. Like, all of that stuff makes me go, bro, it's so hard. So, because I literally thought the same thing. Like, mm-hmm. how do we show grace to this dude? Yeah. And then watching all of the videos of people up there crying and pouring their heart yeah. out, writing, reading their letters to this dude, yeah. and he just sitting there, just like, like, and okay, okay. yeah, like, I got it. I would like, and then you respond with, I again, this is this was medical procedure that I, you know what? I feel like I feel like if your if your lawyers told you to say that, they were setting you up, bro. <laughs> like, yeah. bro, it's not much. I mean, it's major you, you already got sixty years for the child pornography, so right. I was like, what you gonna do? Yeah. They was like, yeah, we are gonna give you sixty years for the child pornography. We are gonna let you do time served all sixty years. You you cool with those? <laughs> yeah. We are gonna give you one seventy five for what you did yeah, to these right. girls. <laughs> right. So you would have been here for two hundred some odd years. Oh my goodness! <laughs> like, like if you died and came back to life, you still oh be in jail my God. for the next one. <laughs> for the next one. I sometimes wonder with people like him, like who've been behaving that way for so long, for him to be able to sit on the stand and say, really say, like it was medical procedure, whether Man. like his lawyers told him to or not. But it's like. Have you convinced yourself of this truth? He had to, to have convinced yourself. yourself. No, he like time. brought he like brought the Bible to the courtroom and stuff, and was like asking for forgiveness and stuff. And that's why the girl said, "Okay, if if this is the Bible that you're holding, like I hope you read it, mm. and I hope one day you come to grips with what you did. And when you do, like the guilt will be crushing." Dang. And that's when she was like, but just what? so you know, that's what makes the gospel so amazing. Somebody said that? Yeah, because there is grace Amen. and mercy for where Amen. none should be found. Amen. Dang. Amen. So it was I'm like, gonna ah, you going to bring that Bible? I hope you know, bro. Wow. I'm not going to lie. So me wow. hearing about this whole situation, like, number one made me feel some type of way because my wife was a gymnast. Yeah. Right, right, right. 
Number two made me feel some type of way because one of my best friends that I've been knowing since I was three was raped. Mm-hmm. So both of those things together was like, oh no, like yeah. no, you gotta go, cut it off. Like you know what I'm saying? You gotta go, <laughs> like <laughs> chop, <laughs> chop. <No! laughs> yes, yeah. Lorena Bobbitt, this no. brother, <laughs> you gotta go. <laughs> like that's where I was because uh-huh. I'm like, <laughs> like. <laughs> The way I treated the dude who raped my my best friend, oh, they never saw him at school again. Like, mm-hmm. I mean, I didn't kill him or nothing. I'm not, <laughs> I'm not saying any of that. Clarify. I just embar- embarrassed him I, very well. I way. absolutely did not kill him. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I did not do that. <laughs> but. But nah, you know what I'm saying? Like. I'm just like that's just whack, bro. Like these girls got to like some of some of those girls are probably like I won't I don't want to do gymnastics anymore. 150 156 girls. So you did this 150 you did this more than 156 times. Mm. Like you did this to 156 girls mm. who came to see you multiple times. Mm-hmm. Had to they were told that he's the best. He and he's he's the one to go. But Man. here's the deal. Here's the deal. Somebody else is at fault. Somebody else needs to get sued. Yes, exactly. He's not the, he's not the only person so, at fault because multiple people came to them like, yo, if you keep hearing about this doctor. And it was like, man, I don't, I, I know the difference between good touch and bad touch. Right. You know what I mean? Yeah. Don't tell me about my body. Stupid. I know I'm what I'm how old? What twelve? You no, no. sixteen. I'm, Get out of here. Come on, man. I know, I definitely know the difference I mean, but between somebody, good touch but and bad touch. But mind you, some of these girls come in, like the, the um, some of the girls overseas, those girls are like 10 and 12 years old, I think, going to the Olympics. Yeah. Like those girls are young. Right. So if we got some girls that's 14, 13 years old, you know what I'm saying? Like, and you a prospect for the Olympics, yeah, you going bro, you in at 13, go. 12, 13 mm-hmm. years old. Man. Yeah. You so these little go, girls bro. are being touched it's, at 12, 13, 14, 15, 16 they, years old, she, bro. Uh, the, um, Allie, I forget her last name. Mm-hmm. She said, this was this is what made me go, dang. She said that he she said I would, he came into her room. They're like, this is after the training hours yeah. and all of that type of stuff. He come, he come, what? I didn't put my mic up when I said, yeah, but oh, go ahead. It's all good. <laughs> um, she, he comes into the room into her room and perform some procedure on her and she had and she's being told that it's procedure while he's like on top of her like you like you're on top of her and she's like he's got his eyes closed while he's doing it i'm like oh man no 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 bro you did this. So, like, so wait a minute. Did, so here's my. There's no. There's no. There's no. Oh, they don't teach this in medical <laughs> school. None. They don't teach this. None. None of it. So here's my. Own, here's my thing with that. That girl had to have gone home and told her parents. Well, that's the thing. There were multiple girls who said like they told their parents and their parents didn't believe them. See, and I that's think for my me, issue. like that. All of this is heartbreaking, but like to get the courage to speak up for yourself and then like your own parents don't believe you. Right. Like that wrecks me because it's like yeah. you're supposed to like you're to not to even like consider no it. Like and to just like at face like just be like, no, you're lying. Right. We're not going to believe you. We're not going to like as a child. Like I can't even imagine how like detrimental that is to like your yeah. your mental space to, right. for like the people who are supposed to be there for you mm-hmm. Protect to basically you. turn their back on you. Yep. And then years later, you're sitting up here with like so many other girls, and it's just like, no. Nah, <laughs> she said, she said, you've you've ruined like the way that I view relationships, Jesus. and like, and I'm like. Dang, she hit it right. She hit the nail right on the head. Yeah. Like the way that, you know, the way that I view people and all of that type of stuff. Like, you shouldn't be living a life like that. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Like, not saying that you should trust everybody, but you, sh- you know what I mean? Like, just yeah. that viewpoint of people you should not have, you know? That sucks. Craziness, bro. man. So, our prayers definitely go yeah. out to, um, I'm going to say victims. The judge said survivors. Yeah. Yeah. I don't know how I feel about survivor. 
Right. I mean, maybe Victoria could tell me how I should feel about Survivor. Yes. I don't know. I don't. I'm not about. I to. mean, I think a lot of people choose to say Survivor because when something like that happens to you, like the internal warfare that happens, that you're constantly battling, and even in some of the the like the stories that the girls tell, like you hear them speak on just how internally a situation like that changes you so much and you're constantly fighting every single day. Mm. And it's mm. like, you can't sleep. You can't think straight. You're scared. Mm. Like you don't want to commit to a relationship, like mm-hmm. how it just alters Dang. you. And so it's like, you're, it's like you're waking up every day and it is like, you're going to war yeah. because yeah. you don't have anybody in your corner you and people. you're fighting all these thoughts by yourself. Like, yeah, I do think you're a survivor because mm. that's not mm. something a normal person has to deal with. Mm every single day Mm, and also victim just and i understand dictionary like victim can have like its base meaning but also that word carries for some people it can just carry such a negative connotation it's just like i'm i've spent every day overcoming these and fighting these feelings so i don't want to see myself as a victim right Mm -hmm. because i'm persevering yeah through it and able to like stand and then so many people like even someone said like she feels like her father committed suicide because Dang. after real life she thinks it was oh, because yeah. of like the guilt of having to deal with the fact that like she, he oh, he didn't believe knew, her. Yeah, yeah he didn't believe her and mm-hmm. upon realizing that all of this stuff was true he felt so much guilt and remorse she believes that that's why he killed himself mm-hmm. and so it's just elements like that as well mm-hmm. it's so much it's so much to deal with mm-hmm. and. I I do view them as survivors because okay. yeah that like it's wild yeah it's hard I, I'm just like I I couldn't I say this but I I couldn't hear my little girl come to me at twelve to eighteen years twelve to a hundred and twelve bro it's nothing to talk her, about right I couldn't hear her come to me and then she say hey dad. This is what the doctor did. He laid on top of me with his hands in places, and I just go, ah, nah, that was procedure. Yeah, like, I'm sure. You know, I'm sure. Like, I couldn't. <laughs> There's a logical explanation. <laughs> right. You know what I'm saying? Let me look man <laughs> laying on top of you. I, like, I'm I not making jokes, y'all laughing. <laughs> right. I would have gone, to, like, it would have been, oh, okay, cool. Like, I'm bringing my gun to the situation. I'm the violent one of the show, guys. I'm just letting you know. Um, I'm bringing- <laughs> But he did not kill. I did not yeah! kill. <laughs> I did, but you gotta I did not. Up with that. Absolutely you gotta did follow not. Up with that. But he stopped going to that school after that, though. <laughs> but anyway, I could not, like, I'm bringing my gun to the situation, <laughs> and we're going to ask him together, what did you do to my daughter? Mm. And if he says, I did this, and she says, no, he did this. Like, we gonna have some issues. There's gonna be some smoke in the city. Mm. It's gonna be some furniture moving in that doctor's I office. I love it. I love that. <laughs> I mm. love that um that phrase, man. Some smoke in the some, city. Gonna be some furniture some moving. Furniture moving. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I'm telling you. Uh, I said old funny. school. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> I love so, it. So Michaela Maroney, she reported it in 2016. Mm. And the US gymnastics. Um, committee um, gave her 1.25 mil as a part of a non-disclosure settlement to stay quiet about it. See, also, yeah, yeah that's another element to all of this. It's what? like the biggest shame on you. Like they all need to go to jail for them and Michigan and like, State for everybody these girls having our everybody said needs to do some time. Nobody listen to them. Like there's nowhere I could know about this and still be working. I'll leave my job. I'm like I can't. I can't do this. The guilt. Like, I'm not with not... this. Yeah. So it's. They gave that girl $1.25 million uh, dollars yeah. to shut up. Yeah, so. Mm. And a part of it was if she said anything, she had to pay $100,000 in fines for saying anything. Oh, so, here's your 100000 So now, so, so Chrissy Teigen like, came out. Put this on black. Chrissy Teigen came out and was like, that's crazy. Don't worry about it. Just go ahead and do what you got to do. I'll pay your fine. Mm. 
So she's amazing. She's dope, bro. <laughs> but uh, uh, yeah, of, of course, you know the, the gymnastics <laughs> committee <laughs> is like, oh, uh, don't we're not gonna pursue the fines. It's okay. Like, don't don't worry about it. Like y'all know y'all can't do because y'all no. look like trash right now. So who is the what's the what's the married couple's name that everybody goes to their house to train? In the, for the Olympics, there's a married. Oh, no. I don't know. I forgot. The I name. do not follow the Olympics. I don't either. But they, I think what year? What year they come? No, they, they've the been doing it for the longest. No, the I, Olympics. Huh? That what year? What year are we in to win the next time we'll see one? 2020. Oh yeah. Yeah. See. Two years. Yeah. <laughs> see. <laughs> but nah, I'm just saying, like, um, they were they were the ones who were sending a lot of the girls to him. Ah. Uh, uh, and a lot of the girls were coming back telling them, hey, this is what's going on. But he's the uh, truck. You know, that's Larry. Larry, wild boy. You know what I'm saying? Ah, <laughs> no, not no, Larry. No, no, no. Larry yeah, somebody, go. somebody else is going to pay. Like, yeah. I, I'm almost. You can't be the only one. Yeah, I'm almost certain of that. Like, negligence or something of the sort. <laughs> I don't think he's the only one going down. <laughs> the judge gonna ask the bailiff what what we gave Larry one sixty five right, right. 150. one fifty you gonna get one fifty because mm-hmm. she was not playing she wasn't she said she I was so excited I, I, feel I, wish, you. I wish he would have had Judge Judy nah. sir <laughs> <laughs> sir excuse me sir <laughs> don't talk over me excuse me sir <laughs> you're yeah. being disrespectful uh, don't right. talk. You disrespect over me. Yeah, Judge, we gonna set it up. Yeah, we read him for filth. 